Well, here we are in the back of the C-Class. I'm uh, almost 190 centimeters tall and I could tell that I'm pretty comfortable in the back. Of course, this is not a S-Class, so if uh, a big person is sitting in the front, I would probably just be a little bit more squeezed, but considering this is a C-Class and not an E-Class or, or not a, like a, a small or a mid or a big SUV uh, type of uh, car, this is quite decent. In the back, we have the uh, window curtains, which are part of the avant-garde package. They look quite cool, I must say, and they give you that little bit of a privacy. We have electrical window as usual. We have the climate control uh, vents where you can adjust um, the air waves. We also have a central armrest where you can put all kinds of different stuff like your phone, for example, fits perfectly. And of course, we have the magic cup holder that you can find and in many Mercedes-Benz models. Uh, again, we have a combination of a bigger and a smaller cup uh, uh, shape so you can fit various uh, cups and cans. Okay, let me close this one. We have in general three places, but mainly two. Of course, you can fit a third person. For example, I can sit right in the middle. That's not a problem. And this is actually my driving position. So there is still quite some space considering I am a generally a uh, big and tall guy. Um, we have on the side the low back support. It's manually adjusted, but it's pretty cool, I must say. And what else? Let's sit behind me. Of course, as you can see behind my place, I don't have that much space, but well, let's be honest. Uh, you're not going to have four people always in the back. So you can, of course, always put your front seat a little bit uh, in front so the rear passenger have also space and let's go to the last part the trunk which is quite big to be honest i think in its class it's one of the biggest ones i don't know the liters by heart i'll probably put them in the post uh, production um, uh, edit you have the rear curtain you have the net which is also quite cool and of course you have the first aid kit together with some electrical stuff and you also have another uh, hidden pocket where you can put various stuff you have quite a, 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 a big trunk in terms of length and in terms of width uh, of course you have a 12 volt plug and classical mercedes style you have the lower uh, back at the lower uh, under tray of the of the trunk where this is the only brand that can find place here because this is the only thing that they produce good and these are the reflect lift, reflective vest that's that's all bmw you can get here that that's the best they can do well guys i hope you enjoy my review let me know in the comment section if you need to know more about this car i guess uh that's for today and see you again next time. Bye.